We are hearing from the daughter of a woman who was shot and killed in her home in Moxville one week ago today. Joshua Davis has been following this story extensively and with permission spoke with one of the victim's young daughters. He joins us live outside the Davie County Sheriff's Office. And Joshua, what did Jade Sales family have to say about her? Well, they're describing Jade Sales as one of the most amazing people you could ever hope to meet and that you couldn't help but love her. She loved everyone the way that they were supposed to be loved. 16-year-old Jayliana Bracken was at school on April 16th when she received news that devastated her family. Her mother, 34-year-old Jade Sales, was shot and killed in their Moxville home. When did you see your mom last, talk to her last? Uh, it was the morning before it happened. Um, I was on my way to school. It was right before I left, and I was like, our last words were, I love you. And she said, I love you more. And... That was the last morning I saw her. Just a month before her death, Jade had given birth. That precious baby girl, along with Jayliana's older stepsister, were inside the home on the day that has forever changed their lives. Jayliana says more than anything, Jade loved being a mom. She was so kind, so loving. She was the most beautiful woman I've ever met. She helped anyone who needed to be helped. She loved everyone all the same. Um, she was so faithful. In our interview, Jayliana opened up about the relationship between the suspect, Dennis Sales, and her mother. Were you aware of any issues between the two of them? Oh, absolutely. Um, they, my mom loved him. He loved her. I know that but couples have their arguments. Although Jayliana says the tragedy is top of mind for all her family, they're honing in on ways to honor Jade's life and legacy. I think that with a little bit more of her love in the world, it could be an amazing place. A GoFundMe has been created for the family in the midst of this tragedy. We'll have a link to that on WXII12.com. In Davie County, I'm Joshua Davis for WXII 12 News.